The Macmillan Support and Information Centre is based on the ground floor of the Cancer Centre. We run a drop-in service where anyone affected by cancer or a red cell condition can call in and speak to us. Whether you're a patient, family member or friend, you don't need an appointment to visit us, just drop in and we'll ensure you're seen as quickly as possible. We provide emotional support, information and a range of supportive activities such as diet talks, art sessions, relaxation classes and support groups. The Mental Support Centre has been great to me. At a time when you're feeling unwell, you're under stress, x-rays, appointments, you're feeling scared, come to some of them, it's find an oasis. The relaxation group has been great for me, it has. It gave me the opportunity to turn off for just for, an, for that hour, it's important. After going through it, look what I'm going through. Here at the Macmillan Centre, I have uh, uh, understanding, kindness, help at one of the trickiest times in my life, and it's fantastic for me. So I only live 20 minutes, uh, four bus stops away, and if I'm on my own in life, I feel that the Macmillan Centre is there for me. It's great. So a lot of the activities here are specifically for patients at UCLH or their carers, family and friends, but we also want to extend our service to those in the local community as well. And really anybody that can, can get to the centre can use us, can come in, speak to one of the specialist information staff here and access any of the booklets, materials that we do. And we can signpost to things that are in their area perhaps that would be helpful for them as well. So we provide support for people with red cell conditions and their families as well. They increasingly come down here and use the centre um, as somewhere to sit and reflect and recover after appointments or to get information or meet other people as well. Our team here in the centre includes welfare and benefits advisors, complementary therapists, the psychological care team including counsellors and psychologists, a trained wig fitter and a dietitian. We encourage patients to discuss their concerns with us so that we can refer them to appropriate services. Our team is supported by a group of trained volunteers who help us deliver a number of support activities to patients and their carers. Well, I first decided that I wanted to come and volunteer at the Support and Information Centre mainly because of the experience of my husband Pete. He was treated at UCH for tonsil cancer in 2009 and although I've lost other family members to cancer, going through the journey with him and being close and realising what a difficult process that is, it made me want to try and help other people who are in the same situation. I help with two different classes here at the centre. The first is Look Good, Feel Better and that's a two-hour skincare and makeup workshop which is run by trained beauty therapists who are also all volunteers and they come in and explain to the ladies how to care for their skin, how to look after their skin during the treatment process and it's a very uplifting session because often obviously they are quite tired and quite overwhelmed while they're going through treatment and often feeling quite low but when they leave the session with all of their makeup on and feeling amazing, it's just fantastic to see what a boost it gives to them. So the second group that I support is called HOPE, which stands for Helping Overcome Problems Effectively. And it's basically a six week course for people who finish their treatment for cancer. And it's really a bit like a stepping stone between that end of treatment phase and helping them get on with the next stage of their lives. I attended the Look Good, Feel Better class today. I'd read about the services um, on their website and a lot of it was just being with other women in a very similar position. You know, we're all facing the same things, losing our hair, you know, our eyebrows are this. And even though for years you've been making yourself up, I guess I'd always just looked like a clown and I'd gone out without having professional advice. So it was lovely to get someone to say, no, no, you don't put blusher on like that why not try this? And you suddenly went, oh yes, I can do that. And it was just nice to share those moments with other people. My first choice it was very much as a second time to me. I feel, um, I feel like I'm surrounded by people who want to stand the minute I'm walking the door. And now that I've come to see it, here now, it's a much, it doesn't feel like coming to a hospital, and 
always say I should for drink and there's a, another Macmillan Centre of Control I can always say hello to everyone because I think of you all as my friends The Macmillan Support and Information Centre is here to support patients, family members and friends at any stage of their experience with cancer or a red cell condition. You can drop into the centre anytime from 9am to 5pm, Monday to Friday.